to Hobo National High School, a school that assures quality basic education, providing the needs of 21st century learners to become globally competent individuals ready to face the challenging future. A learning institution that molds learners mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. Hobo National High School offers complete junior and senior level of basic education program. Senior High School Department offers the following Technical Vocational and Livelihood Tracks Computer Systems Servicing NC2 Electrical Installation and Maintenance NC2 and General Academics Track Hobo National High School A God-given home for everyone A pleasant day everyone I am Marian J. Romano, and I will be your lady of ceremony for today. I know, are you now eager to witness today's special event, especially the parents of our graduating students? So, ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce to you the graduating class for the school year 2020-2021. Yeah. Please tell me that I can't, that I won't, that I fail, that I'll never make it out, yeah Please tell me all the bad, never good, fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah Please say any negative thoughts, I pop off when I hear people say I cannot I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong, I won't stop to the top, so you better back off, I get lost I'ma stay loud, stay proud, never running out, never heading south I'll be spreading out, call it word of mouth, can't put me down, I'll be getting loud You can never doubt, not what I'm about, have your fucking cloud, it be raining now, I keep making sound Go be here and witness this special event, the high point of academic year. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our fourth graduation exercises virtual ceremony of Google National High School with a team, 
strengthening quality education amid COVID-19 pandemic. To start our program, please stand and pay attention for the singing of Lupa Kinira and followed by the prayer to be led by Mr. John Mark F. Habana and of regional hymn, Bicol Hymn, School Hymn. Mga Kababayan, Ang Pambansang Awit ng Pilipinas Almighty God, as we virtually gathered today, we thank you for the blessings of learning. Thank you for the privilege of studying in our chosen dreams and gaining new knowledge. May each graduate today feel proud and enjoy celebrating their success. For this school, which has given us a safe place to learn and a strong foundation to build upon as we take this next step into your world. For our teachers, who have so richly loved and cared for us, even at our worst. For our families, who have cheered us onto the finish line and stood by our sides through the many bumps in the road. We thank you for the friends that we have found among our classmates, for all the jokes that we will laugh, for the hardships and tears we have endured together, and for the love which has been made evident through the relationship we will carry with us beyond this world. Thank you for all the aspects of their time with us, the knowledge gained, the friendships made, the dreams and visions that they carry in their hearts. Father, as we dedicate this celebration to you, we thank you for leading and guiding us all. Amen.
I have the honor to present to you the candidates for graduation for the General Academic Strand or GAS 38 and the Technical Vocational Livelihood or TVL 91 for a total of 129 who satisfactorily completed the requirements under the Basic Education Curriculum of the Department of Education. Ma'am, for your confirmation. By virtue of the authority vested in me as school's division superintendent of DepEd Camarinesur, and upon the certification of your school head that you have satisfactorily completed the requirements for the basic education curriculum of the Department of Education, I now confirm your graduation this July 2021. Congratulations. To inspire our graduates, we shall now hear important messages from our school's division superintendent, Ma'am Loida and Nede. On behalf of the other officials of SDO Kamsur, I take joy and pride in congratulating you all, graduates of school year 2020-2021, as well as your school head, teachers, advisors, parents, and guardians for this very special milestone in your lives. I am confident that our beloved teachers, with the support of the non-teaching personnel and stakeholders, have equipped you with all the knowledge, skills, and attitudes 
essential in addressing challenges in this time of pandemic. This year's theme, Kalidad ng Edukasyon, lalong patatagin sa gitna ng pandemia, is strengthening the quality of education amid the COVID-19 pandemic, focuses on adapting different approaches and strategies for delivering quality education to all Filipino learners. I'm sure the school implemented different learning modalities, modular, which could be hard and soft copies, radio and TV-based instructions, online learning, either synchronous or asynchronous, making blended learning really an alternative way of making education continue. I commend the synergy between and among the school and its stakeholders, the efforts and resources these champions put in the Basic Education Learning Continuity Plan or BELCP, all aim at developing you who will contribute meaningfully to building the nation. Indeed, this is a true manifestation of DepEd's Sulung Idukalidad or KITE, K-12 Curriculum Review and Update, Improvement of Learning Environment, Teachers Upskilling and Reskilling, Engagement of Stakeholders for Support and Collaboration. May their meaningful engagement truly motivate us to complete and help realize our vision and mission to provide all Filipino learners quality, relevant, inclusive, and liberating education, thus helping them achieve their bright future. I thank them for all the opportunities given you. Their support, sacrifice, and aspirations paid off today, your graduation ceremonies. Congratulations, graduates, even if we are experiencing the new and next normal brought about by the COVID-19 pandemic, I'd like you to succeed and be part of the mission to improve the Philippines in whatever role you will assume and wherever you will be destined to be. Again, congratulations and God bless us all. Thank you very much for the very inspiring and insightful message you imparted. Your words will surely guide our graduates as they tread a new path in their lives. May your message motivate them to strive harder. And now, you'll be witnessing the awarding and recognition to the outstanding graduating students. Computer System Servicing NCT with honors. Remy Joy A. Abad. Melka S. Agusto. Maria Liana Nicole P. Alex. Marian Rose S. Almiger. Alona D. Anselis Andrea G. Bani Joy S. Patalier Roy P. Paris
My warmest congratulations to the great and resilient graduates of school year 2020-2021. This school year has been the most challenging in education, 
not only in our country, but around the globe. All had been struggling to survive in all aspects. All of us were shocked of what happened and nobody was prepared. There were so many questions, the hows and whys, but we were able to cross the bridge together with Cathedral of Waves. Whatever are the success stories and hardships, what is important now is the outcome of what you have done. And so here we are, celebrating one of the most precious achievements that you and your parents have, your graduation ceremony. You did great, my dear graduates. It is not easy to be learners with all the pressure in today's world, more so in this hard time due to COVID-19. How you cope up the lessons through distance learning, a varied learning modalities and platforms, the anxiety and distresses of a virus that infected individuals and many more. But you, my graduates, were able to survive amid so many trials. Remember, always hope for the best when you find things difficult. Everyone must keep learning new things throughout our lives. So keep the faith and always believe in yourselves. With hard work, focus, and determination, you will see the dreams and goals are not impossible to achieve. Just have a clear and workable plan. When trials came your way, don't be afraid. Always try to face them with confidence and conviction that those are part of the obstacles and drawbacks where we cannot evade. Be strong and allow your education and learnings be your shield. Your family and friends must be proud. As graduates, this is a proud moment for all of you as well as to your school administrators, teaching and non-teaching staff. I commend you for your hard work and perseverance amid COVID-19 which led to this milestone. Always bear in mind to observe the right attitude. Remember, you are not simply preparing for life, rather you are experiencing the ups and downs of life. And the beauty of this is not simply to gain knowledge and wisdom, but it is a confirmation that you have grown up and proven yourself to be resilient, especially this time of hardships and all. Be strong, graduates. You are to enter another battlefield in your journey. Remembering how hard you work will precisely keep you moving on. The experience you gained in school had somehow helped you become a better person, ready to face challenges and life encounters. Don't forget those who guide you sincerely as you walk the path. Those who are always with you in times of successes and downfalls. They are your parents teachers, relatives, and best friends. To all our parents and guardians, your contribution towards the re realization of your learner's dream is so great and wonderful. Sustain it and you will harvest the fruits of it sooner than later. Thank you, my dear parents and guardians. You are the silent heroes for partnering with DepEd through your learner's education. My salute also to our local government units and leaders and to all other stakeholders who had helped and extended untiring support to our school in order that DepEd can comply its mission and vision. Always be a blessing to everyone. Congratulations and keep safe and may God bless us all. Warm greetings to graduates and completers. What an experience we had this school year 2020-2021. The COVID-19 creates a different world for everyone. Yet, it cannot and may not stop education. Let us be grateful to your parents for their never-ending support extended and who patiently did their best as co-facilitator of learning. 
the teachers who never get tired of doing the task for without them there would be no graduation completion today and most importantly to our god almighty for giving everyone the strength the courage to move on and good health amidst this pandemic let me take this opportunity to share with you this five letter word peace p-e-a-c-e -E, that may guide you dear graduates and completers as you venture the next journey in your life p proactive you must act in anticipation of the difficulty you will face as you conquer the world may it be in the academy work or business being a product of the senior high school you must take an extra role in dealing with something you must undertake completers be patient as you continue your journey to the senior high school e earnest you must show deep sincerity in your studies or work be diligent skillful in anything that you do take all the opportunity at hand be courageous as you hurdle all the difficulties in life don't quit when life gets bitter or hard success is given only to those who persevere a abiding enduring even problem comes along the way you must have the zest to follow your dreams never let poverty or problems stop you from getting what you want in the future make your family your inspiration abide to your parents and teachers instructions letter c candidness openly straightforward and sincere in your studies or work you are doing as an adult you must be trained to act correctly you must be honest and truthful always in attitude and in your speech so that when you grow old you will be used to it your future depends on how you prepare now the last letter is e elated or high spirited extra joyful as you pursue your dreams be serious in what you do but you must be on high spirit manage your time properly Choose your friends and companions and enjoy the company of your family. Never venture in vices or activities that will give or make you regret in the future. Maging kayong masayahin no? sa inyong mga ginagawa. Try to love your work. The joint effort of the school, the home, and stakeholders is a proof that together we can. As our years theme strengthening quality education amid the covid 19 pandemic we surpassed difficulties this school year because of synergy combined actions of everyone be inspired of what they have done and what they will do in the coming days for you to become what you want to be may i leave you this quote by lyndon b johnson peace is journey of a thousand miles and it must be taken one step at a time. Be of good health always and have a prayerful life. Hope to see you someday as somebody. Congratulations and God bless. LG1B, Computer System Servicing NC2. RJC Abrex Roy P. Barrios Marvin B. Guates Jericho A. De La Torre Gerald S. De La Torre Allen in play Jasper P. Ako Miko G. Parawan Remy Joy A. Abad Militar S. Augusto Jeneline Elena Maria Liana Nicole B. Alena Marian Rose S. Almichel Alona D. Anselmo Andrea G. Bani Kathy F. Barat Shahida Nate B. Barbacet Jo 
Salier. I will greet the Patoyan. My name O Billion. Joy B. Bell.
everything has changed, an expensive adjustment must appear. The usual face-to-face -face interaction are strictly prohibited and turned into unusual methods such as learning at home through modular and online. It gives struggle to parents in getting and bringing the modules for their children. This setup also stress teachers in printing fonts of modules and checking endless of papers. It's not easy for us students to study in an environment where supposedly our rest place. I am one of you having a hard time in learning by myself Keep asking how it becomes the answer. I know all of us have felt so much grief as we missed a lot of activities and memories in our last year here in Kubo National High School. Pandemic may not let us to experience what are usually the life of a grade 12 student. However, this crisis taught us how to handle challenges that the life has thrown us and made us realize that anything is possible as long as we put our minds and heart in our action. Reminiscing the old days, I know you all miss the feeling of shouting until our throat gets dry to support our classmate in pageant and sports, being annoyed because your classmate keeps asking to braid her hair, the happiness when there is a conference, and passing a piece of paper during exams. Before, when we headed to our home, we don't any feel sad because there is assurance that on the next day, the place and the faces are still the same. However, today, as we step outside the school, the people we usually saw, hang out with, are totally different as we enter into a new and bigger world. Today, we are in a situation where we are torn between excitement for the future ahead and anxious for stepping out of our comfort zone. To some of us, graduation is just the next step to our education. Some are headed to universities, community colleges, and vocational schools to pursue their dreams. However, graduation to others is the end of their education as they choose to seek a job and earn for a living. Nevertheless, I look forward hearing our success in the future, wearing the uniform of our dream profession, and attaining the life we desire. I hope you find time celebrating your victories, even if it's small and simple. It doesn't matter whether your progress is low. One thing is certain. You are moving forward. Your little progress matters. I pray that Class 2021 will look ahead with proud feeling and smile with confidence. Spread your wings and dream feeling. Congratulations to everyone. Thank you. Thank you. May we take this opportunity to thank everyone who unselfishly cooperated and participated in any undertakings of this year's Kubo National High School graduation. To all of you, thank you very much. For the Pledge of Loyalty, may I call on Miss Heart Joy B. Halamani, followed by Alumni Oath by Miss Maria Bianca S. Valley. I do solemnly swear my undivided loyalty to my alma mater to do my obligation willingly and faithfully to God Almighty and to my Father, to uphold the name and honor of my alma mater and whenever I am and whatever I may be. I pledge further to hold this diploma as an emblem of my responsibility to serve God my country and fellow men, with honor to myself, with loyalty to my school, and with fidelity to my faith.
I do solemnly swear to uphold and abide by the Constitution and by laws of Hugo National High School Alumni Association to commit myself, help and participate in the affairs of association to the best of my knowledge and ability to bring honor to myself, my alma mater, to the community, the alumni association, my country, and to impose upon myself this responsibility voluntarily without any mental reservation. So help me God. Let us now listen to the Senior High School Coordinator, Mr. Felix D. Marcaida, for the closing remarks. My salutations to you, graduates of 2021. Despite the challenges made to us by this COVID-19 pandemic, you did not lose your hope and eagerness to finish what you have started. Thank you very much for being the students we wanted you to be. You doubled your efforts, you doubled your hard work, and most especially, you doubled your patience. Now, it is time for you to reap what you sow and be prepared for the next journey of your lives. Celebrate the success with your family and enjoy the outcome of your efforts. Kindly send my compliment to your parents for their incomparable efforts made during this pandemic. Yakapin niyo sila. Masalamatan niyo sila sa kanilang walang sawang pagtsatsaga upang magbalik-balik sa school para kumuha at magsaulit ng inyong mga modules. Also, for without their unselfish efforts, you will not be in this success. Go forth and be what you wanted to be. Carry the torch and banner of your beloved alma mater and make her proud. Before I formally close this program, allow me to do my culture in every commencement exercises of our beloved Pubu National High School. That is to give you a challenge, a seven-year challenge. Come back to us after seven years and tell us what you become. And we will tell the world how proud we are for you. In behalf of your teachers and advisors in senior high school, congratulations. Stay safe. Keep safe. God bless you. At tigit sa lahat, sumayin nyo ang kabutihan. Congratulations, graduates! And to the proud parents, go forth, grow, and be successful. A philosopher once said, success is not a failure. Failure is not fatal. But it is the courage to continue that counts. In behalf of the school's faculty and staff, we joyfully congratulate the graduates, their parents, and advisors. Thank you very much.